What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the Vintage Cube. Badger is just about to leave, so everybody say goodbye to Badger. And uh, Thank you. their wonderful self. Badger with the, the 10 gifted subs, never to be outdone. And uh, I so appreciate I was going to donate 20 and my sass. I was punished by, by my own sass, apparently. Badger, you have donated Thank more than enough, and I appreciate everything you do, my friend. I am not a first pick Liliana kind of person. I'm more like a first pick Golos, and that's what we're going to do. I'm this one. one's for Super oh. Fritz. Okay. What are you going to say? I was going to say that or Apparition Boy. I don't know if that guy's a turn one or. I mean, he's pretty banger. Hodge Gulashi with the gifted. So I love you guys. Thank you. I love. Hey, man, 54 months? That's almost five and a half years. Who's 54 months? That was me. Could have been longer you. if you. Yeah, if but I. You, but you planned. Uh, <laughs> it it could have actually been quite a bit longer. If I didn't care. Thank Technically, you. I could have been your longest sub. But you planned. No, nah, I didn't have money. But I didn't have any money. We're starting time along five bucks a month. <laughs> what do you think? I'm a rich man. <laughs> He's a rich man. He's like, oh, to. Thank you. I can't tell if, Ka if Katie's asleep or mad. Both. Thank you. What's going on? Oh, my God. So many gifted subs. Hodge Gulashi with gifted 10. Oh, my goodness gracious. What is even Thank happening? I, I thought it was two for some reason. Hodge Gulashi, buddy. I love you, dude. Oh, my God. Badger and Hodge Gulashi, you guys are wonderful. Thank you. Thank you so much, my peeps. I'm going to take Mystic Confluence just because I like it the most. Or Ren and Six. You like Ren and Six, Michael? Thank you. Let's Ren and Six. Yeah, you're pretty cool. Uh, guys and gals. I, I use... I use... Uh, I use guys pretty pretty non non genderally just to be clear. Thank you. <laughs> Bloodstained Mire goes pretty well with this this Thank thing you. this creature this thing creature. Oh, Hajigalashi gifted a tier one sub to fart. <laughs> so that's nice. That's solid. Thank you. I like ignoble hierarch, but with a Ren and six, we're just taking this Bloodstained Mire. Do you say it like the Italian Mire? No. Thank you. No. Well, it's your loss, oh. I guess. Does it bother you that you're such an uncultured swine? No. Yeah. CN for president. Thank, Thank you for the you. sub, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. You know what does bother me? <sighs> no, I don't care. I'm good. Thanks, man. Thank you. Just you. Gotta, you just got to shut them down before they get too free, because otherwise they're just going to say anything that's on their mind, you know? Is that what your friends? No. I'll go now. Where are you going to go? Thank you. Oh, Marsh Flats and Arid Mesa up in this piece? Marsh Flats. Well, Iron Mace is red, which is Ren and Six, but Marsh Oh, that's Flats... a good point. Oh, man. Anyway, all I was going to say is that... I said I don't care, Michael. I don't care. I'm saying it anyway. Fuck you! Oh, Golos dear. <laughs> is like one of my favorite commanders, but I can't play him anymore because you just can't play Golos. Or we could just take Dak Faden and hope one of these wheels, but I'm going to take the Iron Mace, I think. He too strong. <sighs> Could just take Botanical Sanctum. It's not one of my favorite lands, but we're definitely five coloring here. And turn one Botanical followed by either of these fetch lands still lets us play a run in six. Uh, so Golos is an awkward spot where he's too strong for casual games, but he's too weak for competitive. So it's really awkward. So if you play against a random table, people are just going to target you immediately because Golos is just that strong. He's kind of like a boogeyman. He doesn't do anything particularly broken. He's just too generically good. He just leads the piles of value. I think we just want Torrential Gear Hulk and hope that I get something sweet to play with it. I don't care about Gaius Cradle. Shambling Vent's actually kind of fine. I think Torrential Gear Hulk is much stronger than Kitchen Finks if we can get the cards for it. I'm also not actually opposed to Wall of Omens. I kind of like Grist here. As long as it's as long as it's anywhere but the battlefield, it's a one one insect. So you can green sun for it, you can finale for it. You can green sun for that guy? Yeah, it's a creature in your deck. Oh, that's a banana banger. <laughs> you can sack I a creature a to destroy a creature planeswalker, which is also pretty decent. Hmm. Could also be Sacred Foundry. I think it's Sacred Foundry. Oh, we can that's get it with so bananas. Oh, he's just Michael's just figuring it out now. Oh, he's like, god. Oh my god. 
oh, it's going like in every deck that can play it. That's hilarious. Oh my god, that's so good. <laughs> the fact that you can green something you know, is so good. Yeah, it's a one one green creature in your deck. It would still be you'd have to green some for f three. Four. Well, yeah, four. You X is three. Yes. Yeah. So uh, good. Temple Garden's pretty sweet. We can get it with. Our it's like a tutorable. Thank you. The removal. That's that's a banana. It's, oh, so good. I love how I love how superfluous banana banger is now. What's Hodge the, Goulashi with a gifted sub to banana bangers. Right? Is that, how is that? A, how is that a channel? <laughs> I really wanted that Archon of Cruelty, but I think I got to take the Temple. It's just too good for us. Oh look, Sylvan Skyclave Apparition came. How back. much does a cool art for that good cost? For this? No, for for a. Uh, oh, it's not. It's book. not expensive. I think it's like less than fifteen. Might as well be free. No, it's no, it's less than fifteen. In my eyes, it's basically free. None of these cards, all these cards are are fine, but I don't know what's best for us right now. Probably Skyclave. I think it's just really, really good. Yes, every Twitch user is technically a channel. That's correct. Is that true? Mm -hmm. Like I can literally pr press go live, even though I have no way to do it. I guess my phone can do it, but well, that's what I mean. But like, that's my point. Well, how is how is Banana Bangers a Twitch channel? How is it a user? That's my question. Like, someone entered Banana Bangers as their name? That seems really weird. Why? Because it's not a... Because it doesn't seem like a thing someone would just make a name for. Because it's a very obscure, like, phrase that I said randomly one day. No, I think Banana Bangers is like a thing. It's definitely not. You sure? Yes. Google Banana Bangers. Okay. <laughs> I want to take Toski. That guy could draw some cards. Oh, Huntmaster coming back is nice. Mm, okay, two level up cards, I guess. Come on, last last pick Archon of Cruelty, even though I don't even know if that's how the packs would play out. Thank you. Lance, what up, dude? Hey, on vacation with the wife, so I can't hang out. Dude, I appreciate you signing on just to, just to sub. Banana Banger is apparently a cocktail. That's interesting. I'm now very intrigued. Interesting. What is in it? Let's see, man. Let's find out. Does it contain bananas? All right. Bun Bundaberg rum. You ever heard of that? Shieldred's kind of no, like... No, but I'm a fan of rum. Uh, half a cup of Thank ice, you. a third of a fresh banana, 30 milliliters of cream, and 30 of orange juice. It sounds like an orange Julius. Sounds amazing. What's Bundaberg rum? Let's find out. Oh my god, Hodge, Hodge Galaxy gifting to Banana Banger in 2020. <laughs> oh, look at that little kitty. Bundaberg rum is a dark rum produced in Bundaberg, Queensland, Australia by the Bundaberg Distilling Company. It is often referred to as Bundy. In 2010, the Bundaberg Distilling Company was inducted into the Queensland Business Leaders Hall of Fame. Interesting. Oh, uh, is it expensive? Uh, Let's go shopping tab. Oh, Okay. Uh, Mana Vault seems good. Let's oh no, up. that's reasonable. Twenty oh, bucks, thirty 20 bucks. bucks. Bob. Yeah, we'll Super hit up reasonable. the we'll hit up the um, the Lucans, and we'll go grab some. Well, not the actual Lucans, but also it might not be local though. That might actually not be. I'm sure it's imported here. Yeah, but like in this town, in this time of year, in this, <laughs> and I was localized just, to your kitchen. Man, I have like all those ingredients basically. Uh, I think it's just Mana Vault here, right? Sure. Why not? Oh, Scrublin can be can be searched by Arid Mesa and Bloodstain Mire, so that's pretty cool. Oh, super rich. Just to explain a little better, like you build goals and like I'll include all these cool creatures, like you know uh, the, the Praetors and like a bunch of other cool guys, and then you just realize you have a bunch of big creatures that you can cast your commander, and the immediate turn after you play a land, you just get to play three things at the top of your deck for free, and it's just always way too good. If I didn't care, um, so I think we're just taking Lotus Cover because if we're trying to find a deck that's built around. Whatever fetch lands we can we can grab, I think this is good. Tundra's also good. We can get it with Arid Mesa, but I think we're cobring here. Oh, I like a fallen shinobi. Then you're gonna have a Kenrith though, so what's the difference? Also an upheaval. I don't think we're upheavaling though. We do not seem like an upheaval. We have two Praetors right now though, that's pretty cool. Praetor treachery? Me? Yeah, oh, we're Praetor treachering. You. Treachering. You ever been treachering? Godless Shrine. We already took the Scrubland, though. 
Interesting. Maybe Gilded Goose is just a play here. I'm telling the loose. What about the end of the Bundle Bear? I'm sorry, fucking what? Bundle Bear? Bundle Bear? Did you just name after the rum? Yeah, I was doing a little combo. <laughs> a little combo. I did a little, a little combination move there for you. I kind of like Fatal Push here, especially with Fetch Lands. Yeah, we'll Fatal Push. This deck is looking something, man. The only person I'm gifting the bottle to is myself. Frank, don't do the alcohols. You don't know me. I do actually pretty well. As it turns out. Oh, Plateau is nice. That's a great pickup. Oh, except we already have Sacred Foundry. God, I can't win here. Maybe it's Goldspan Dragon, actually. Yeah, you can have two of the of land. I don't know about all that. You sound like a crazy person. <laughs> I don't like this as a basic planes. Knight of the Reliquary or Knight of the White Orchid is is a planes card, so you can actually get pretty much anything. There's also double white, so it's kind of like also difficult. I don't know what you're saying right now. You do. I have no idea. All the ideas. Oh, oh yeah, I like a tireless tracker that goes well with our with our landfall plan. <laughs> That's a good pick. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe are you absolutely mad? Is that our money? Did we get it yet? Yeah, this is from the USPS. They gave us our money. Sick. Can I have it now? <sighs> no. <laughs> it looks like a generic email. It doesn't mean anything. It is. Nice. This has been a great time. I really enjoy leasing companies. Oh, we forgot to watch the YouTube video. This has nothing to do with the USPS. That we're not getting a U USPS is no longer in the equation, as I told you. I don't know why you keep thinking we're going to hear from USPS about it. There's nothing to do with USPS anymore. Well, I thought you might have responded to him and I didn't see an email or something. There's more to it. Responded to who? The rental people. But what does that have to do with USPS? Well, I assume it would eventually be reshipped by them. No, it's not getting reshipped. Well, like, yeah, but what, what USPS isn't going to send me an email and be like, hey, your thing was shipped by this person. Maybe. That is not how that works. I'm going to take Copper Line. Gorgeous. Me, no, no. U UPSPS sounds like a hell of a company. USPSPS. PS. <laughs> that's uh, that's a little cat things. <laughs> oh, Lonus. All right, this deck is weird now. I'm definitely taking this idiot out. I don't have a single instant except for Fatal Push. This is just Fat Daddies. Fat Daddies. Check it and see. I hear Katie stomping around, so I think she's still awake. Is it Anger Stomps? Yeah, she's just mad that she can't poop on her toilet because of the because of the clog. We do have more than one of those though, so that's pretty good. Yeah, but not being able to poop in your own toilet is not fun. No one wants that. We got a downstairs toilet. It's like you're not even listening to what I'm saying anymore. Well, it's not like a public restroom, man. It's still in her house. It's not her toilet though, you know. Oh, mock sapphire and a mana crypt. This is a tough call. No, it's my I feel like our curve's for you. Okay. What are you going to say? Our curve's kind of high, but... Yeah, but like half the things it can't cast. It can't cast this. It adds one mana for this, which is the same as Mox Sapphire. It can't cast this. Adds one for this, like Mox Sapphire. That guy's good. It adds one for this, like Mox Sapphire. But then it can't cast you, any of these. So if you ignore everything that costs three or less, then it's very good. When did Lyra get here? Is that a last pick? She snuck in. Yeah, I'd still rather have a colored source for a deck that's five colors. Also, your flip your flip equity is bad. Your flip, your flip, flip equity? Equity. You're always taking three. You're getting dumbed every time. Okay, buddy. Take it easy. It basically cuts your life in half when you cast it. <laughs> it cuts my life into pieces. <laughs> is it your last resort? <laughs> what about Celestia Signet? You like that thing? Or do you like Teferi? I think we need ramp. I do too. Fast and Teferi hurts, but what are you going to do? I was wondering if the the red white one was better. No, because no, we have double close. green, 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 we green. It's like double white, double white, but that's kind of really high end double white. So They yeah. both have white. What are you saying? Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's like. It's, well, no, I meant we have double red, 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 right? So Okay, so we have three red cards. Four. This Thank this you. balances out because it's a green card as well. Same as this. Oh. So these break even. That's a good. Point. So here's our red cards versus our green cards. 
Hmm. So you think the red's more important is what you're saying here? Yeah, because it's cooler. Okay, it's not. I like dragons. <laughs> I like Ugin here. Corsair of Crufix actually seems great, though. Let's take Corsair. I feel like a top end's pretty, you know? It's pretty what? It's up there. It's a top end. It's supposed to be. What about Mirari's Wake? No, we don't have a Mirari's Wake. Let's just take Euro. Euro seems like a banana banger, right? <gasps> Stomper. We can get it with Arid Mesa and Bloodstained Mire. Oh, that's that's a good one, especially yeah. because we can... Uh, it's a... Get both sides cast Ren and Six. Oh, Badlands. I don't have a black. Oh, I don't have a. Oh, Omnath, though. Oh, we're Omnathing for sure. Is this pack two or pack three? 21 plus 14? Pack Probably three. pack three. Oh, no, Omnath. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah, that's exciting. Hajgulashi gifted a sub to Papa Roach. Thank goodness. Next time Papa Roach is in the channel, I'm going to be really glad. You ever pop a roach? <laughs> oh, got him. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Why? Why, God? <laughs> Why? I kind of like Gargaroth here. Actually, maybe just Quasalite Pride Mage. Yeah, I feel like we need the low end, you know. Or face fitters. No, we got enough life gain. Kosali. Could just be Celestial Colonnade, too. You can get it with goals. That's pretty cool. All right, I like Colonnade, yeah. That's good. Oh, Racto Sigmet's nice. Not so Court, but... Right. Court? Oh, I like Court a lot, though. Yeah, but you I put feel a like land need... from your hand on the battlefield. If you're the monarch, say you put a creature on land. It's like four mana, though. I think we need the two drop stuff. Yeah. Then again, we're not really that black, so... We don't have to make creatures. We have 16 creatures? Oh, that's more than I thought. Yeah, we just got a bunch of fat boys, like I said. I kind of like the Signet here. Oh, Breeding Pool? Wow, that's nice. That's a solid pickup. Because we're basically like a blue-green deck, right, that's splashing the other colors. We have like three blue cards. Look at that. Say look. Look at part, part, Figure it out. One, two, three, four, no, five. No, don't do it. We still have more blue of the other things than the other things, you know? Inferno Titan End is a good one. Um, double black for Choops. Okay, we're about even on... So we're like Rug splashing the other two. Final answer. Final Jeopardy. Number one. <laughs> Yeah, that's like Rakdos return, sure. Yeah, hero. Frasca last pick. Okay, we have 25 cards. I think we cut Shieldred. Because double black seems harder than double white, maybe. Yeah, I agree with that. Plus, we already need double white early, so. That's what Michael B's for. All right. Can we cut black entirely? No. Then we're losing Kolagon's Command, Maelstrom Pulse, Fallen Shinobi, Rakdos Signet becomes worse, Fatal Push, uh, Scrubland doesn't hit, Bloodstained Mire, like... I'm saying we do it. I'm just, I'm just thinking out loud, you know? That's called talking. Yeah. Huh. Okay. We could definitely replace some more white cards. I don't know if it's good, but we could do it. <coughs> then again, blue, I don't think you have it in it to cut you a Shinobi. I don't think you've ever done that. Why would I do that? Okay. For mana base, white, we have one, two, three, Bloodstained Mire, four, five, six, and one Signet. Blue, we have no. No. So we have one, two, three, four. Black, we have one, two, three, four. Three and one. Red, we have one, 
two, three, four, five, and one. So six total. And green we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one. And I think you double counted on the green, but. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Sacred Foundry is in green. One, two, three, five, six, seven, eight. Seven. Okay. Okay. I, mean, I think we're going to green, so it doesn't matter. Too so much, black but. is our least represented. So I'm going to take out the shield red. Yeah. Um. We have a lot of white sources, which is nice. Um, we don't have a ton of blue. But this is 11, so we're actually going to get six more basics, which is pretty good. Oh, wow. We have six more? Yeah. We have a ghoul. Definitely want a planes. Probably one of each, just because of goals. Oh, I like that. Probably two blue because we have double blue, 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 early blue stuff. Dabba dee, dabba die. Also, we have goose, which also counts for everything. And goldspan dragon also helps. Yes. Um, but kind of later and only if you have red, so it's a bit challenging, but just like your life, a little bit challenging. Everyone's life is challenging, man. Just yours. Gotti. Take a fatal push, maybe. It's not super exciting. It's yeah, plus I think like black, sure. Even though we have a mox, I think like having extra land in this deck is going to be good. Okay, so plus we, we said one of everything. One, two, three, four. They're adding five, which would put us to 39, which is kind of weird. So we're going to add one here and one here. Cut this. And that'll do 16 lands and we do have a mox. So, all right. I listen to Michael's heavy size. I'm tired. <sighs> Michael, it's not even it's not even ten o'clock yet. You trying to trick me, boy? Oh, what up, Danny Bambino? Bambarino? Thank you for the raid, buddy. Really appreciate it. We'll see how it goes. Can't guarantee I can save for the whole thing. If you leave, you owe me twenty dollars. Jackson, you already do. <laughs> No, additionally, and Dang. not related to anything else. If I stay, do I owe you twenty dollars less? No. Hmm. If you leave, you owe me twenty dollars. If you don't, you don't. I didn't agree to this. You agreed to it when you didn't leave. Oh, so oh, I should what leave up, then, Sammy. What? So I should leave then. Who is this? <laughs> Hello, Grandpa. Are you there? It's me, Billy. It's been so long. <laughs> How long is it going to keep going? Who knows? Do you see this meme that's present on my on my computer screen, Michael? Here, I'll show it to everyone. Wait. I don't understand. <laughs> is it supposed to be like a weird cat or what's... When you take a picture of a black cat, you can't see any detail. It just looks like a black oh, blob. Okay. Why is that? I don't get it. Well, I thought it was deeper than that. I thought I was missing something. Well, you clearly were. Yeah, it's, it's called a brain. It was called the joke. And a brain. A joke and a brain? Yeah, a joke brain. You're missing your joke brain? Mm hmm. Wild. As well as all the other brains' parts. What? Nobody knows. God, he's really going to town right now. Okay, so I could play Lotus Cobra off this, and then I get two, but that doesn't do anything. So I guess we'll just play a land and play Cobra by itself. Next turn, we have one, two, three, four, five mana. We can Golos. Would you like that, Michael? Would you like yeah. the Golos? He's my friend. This is four mana. What are they doing? Lotus Cobra. One, two, three, four, five mana. Okay. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna oh Jesus God? It's gonna be our death, is what's gonna be. Oh dear Jesus. They have the actual pro Jenny. They got it's pro Jenny, we got we're in big doo-doos. It's gonna be a big woody. 
Oh boy, that's well, fun. I think we're dead to that. I don't think we have any answers, unfortunately. I'm trying to think of our deck. I don't think anyone make them sacrifice anything. <laughs> but you don't know. So why don't you shut up? But hey, you know, you, you play it out sport. Okay, champ. I believe in you. Jim Jiminy. Jim Jiminy. You sacrifice your food. Now you're dead for sure. I feel like racing is going to be a little rough. They might not know that they can't block that guy. What do you mean? I mean, they can't block that guy. The questing beast? Yes. Well, they're not going to block anyway because they're going to attack. Right, but I have vigilance. So you're right. I probably should have played it here, I guess. I still don't see a scenario where that wins you the game, but... You don't have to. There's not enough time. Mayor Golf Sips will be out. <laughs> Just kidding. Uh, must be, as the kids say. Yeah, let's just go to the next game. Yeah, that's not going to do it. Okay, well. Children's back on the menu. I mean, we're never going to get to seven mana before they have two creatures on board. But maybe. Exactly. No. Got to play your outs. That's Even if they're not terrible. <laughs> If you board in one million fatal pushes, they'll never be able to sack it. What are you saying right now? You just always push them off the ledge. Are you someone's drunk uncle? Basically, yeah. That's wild. Wally is my nephew. Jesus. Oh, boy. He's also a perfect angel sent from heaven. Gotta be a run and six that I can't play. Oh, scrub a uh, scrubbles. Just one step closer to... The edge, and Command. I'm about to break. Or that. <laughs> Everything you say to me. <sighs> Who sings that song? My dad. It's Lincoln Park, isn't it? Yes. Okay. The Drunchel. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, they're going to kill us with Come another on, big... dude. They're going to kill us with the other big monster now. If we can draw one land and then give us one turn, we get to stretch. Oh, nope, never mind. Cool. Hajulashi gifted sub to Lincoln Park. Thank you, buddy. Hopefully, Lincoln Park will appreciate it and they'll continue the sub after it expires. <laughs> that would be great. Do you think it's the actual Lincoln Park? I mean, who else would it be? <laughs> oh, that's actually hilarious. If only this cost four or less. Yep, this is a good. This is a good series of games. Turn to channel into Ulamog and then uh, natural or inner progenitus. Fun time had by all. 50% of the people playing in those games had a Just great king. time. Let's watch that vid. No. Mm, he's too mad. It's crime and punishment. And it's Russian. Well, that much I knew. Right. So, but it's a Russian crime and punishment. You don't, he doesn't get it. I don't actually. I know. It's painful. Yes, it's the, yes, it's a, it's a, yes, exactly. Thank you, Nick Squirt. Crime Punishment is a classic Russian literature by Dostoevsky. So to have a Crime and Punishment card in Russian, it's like an homage to the, to the book Crime and Punishment, which is a Russian piece of literature. Yeah. You have to know that to know that. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? You'd have to know that to know that. Yeah, it's true. You would have to know that to know that. 
Into his heart some rain must fall. So I can play Lotus Cobra into Huntmaster, but I can also just play Lonus into Lotus Cobra into Ren and say that seems better. Let's do that. What can I say? I was, you know, American education, so. I also had an American education. Yeah, but you're like an English boy, you know, so. <laughs> you're an, yeah, you're an English boy, so you know more about those Russian books. No, but you know what I mean. Yeah, you're, you're into yeah. literature. I took some literature. I took English literature, like actual, like, England literature in college but name two books you studied in english literature uh that would be portrait dorian gray uh i don't remember anymore <laughs> <laughs> i remember the one i liked and read so you could have just made one up if you <laughs> oh sorry let me pull classic michael b the great adventure of the sir squirlington and well no Chum. i meant make one up as in like one you, no, like never mind like just reference a book that isn't correct, like a, a, an English book that that Catcher, wasn't. I love Catcher in the Rye. That's Such not a classic English. English literature. No, that's not how that works. <laughs> but that was that was the joke. Yes. Unfortunately, J.D. Salinger's pretty uh pretty not okay, dude. Oh, they're no, gonna reanimate Terastodon and kill two of my lands. It's gonna be good. Harry Potter. Does that really count? I heard Garfield at large. What? Wait, what? Oh, yeah, okay, sure. Wait, that was... <laughs> they just drew two. They drew two and... Oh, and how could bounce. I get bananas and pajamas, too, though, for the banana kind? My favorite English literature <laughs> that I wrote. You wrote that? Yeah. I'm older than you think. How old are you, Grandpa? 79. Unfortunately, we actually can't play Lotus Cobra into Lawness here, so we're just going to play Lawness again. <sighs> Want to see me Lawness? Want to see me Lawness again? No, that's you're Can making. Can you read the full text of that guy? Whenever another non-token creature enters the battlefield, investigate under you your control. Clue. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Tap it and sacrifice X clues. Target opponent reveals the top X cards of their library. You may put a non-land permanent card with mana value X or less from among them onto the battlefield. So it's kind of like a villainous. It's a one-shot villainous wealth. Hmm. That's pretty cool. But you got to sacrifice like what seven clues to make it worthwhile to make sure you hit like. I feel like if you in commander non land, if you want to make clues, permanent, yeah, it's easy to do. If you want to <laughs> make clues, it's easy to do. There's a lot of clue makers. Why don't they just attack first to, like, it's like I have a one two and a planes. Just attack and draw two and without a discard. You just don't know because most clue cards are terrible. Outside of commander, discard even in they're just terrible. Doesn't you make just, sense. You know, it's good with him. Yeah, sure. Oh, take another turn. I yeah, still don't know why they just didn't attack here. You just take all the turns. I want to play. Fuck me, I guess. God, he got real aggressive. That's how it feels when your opponent takes extra turns. That's how it feels when your opponent takes extra turns. My name is Michael. How many times do I have to go over this? It's my shickle. Okay. My shickle? <laughs> I had to twist this side. <laughs> So apparently we have to go over it a few more times because really you've never gone over that. My shakur. Where are you? With the oh, main phase topping. So that means you probably have nothing. Tire. Are you talking still? Yeah. Please stop. The people like it. Do it's they? Can we get a can we get a show of hands in the chat? How many people like Michael talking? My my shakul, mishkul, whatever you said. So you don't even know. It's half the fun. This is the air quality index. Do you see what it's at? 69. Michael. Alert. Oh, nice. Except for it's actually not alert. Nice. <laughs> yeah, get wrecked. <laughs> it's going to be overwhelmingly positive. I know. Yeah. yeah it's, what is this hands? Show, it's literally emote show of hands. Wow. All right. <sighs> okay. Like Katie hates me right now. But I may be dumb, but I am super entertaining. Buddy, I may be dumb. That's the end of the sentence. The end.
thing to you? Maybe. Man, what if that was the other guy instead? Oh, wait. You know, wait. Red, white. Yeah. Oh, someone Omnath. tell me what he's saying. I was going to say, what if it was Omnath? Omnath? Oh, look at that, look at that clue, bro. Look at that dead hand. He he didn't get his clue, you know? That's why he died. Oh, dang. Jesus, that's Michael. I'm so sorry. You're the future of America? <laughs> Actually, I'm not. I'm definitely not the future of America anymore. I'm old now. Yeah, that's, that's true. I'm no longer the future Your of America. time to make an impact is gone. Do you guys know I have an employer who pays me significantly decent money? Bet. <laughs> oh, here we go. I guess we're dead. They got two cards in hand. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hodge Galasha, you're 40 this week? Happy birthday, buddy. Rip. Well, see you later. I'd rather not actually go on my employer name on stream. There's no real reason, real benefit to that. True story. I work for a bank. No, you don't. You work at McDonald's, you liar. Yeah, but I'm the president now. <laughs> <laughs> they gave me a promotion. Now they call me Michael McDonald. Oh, dear. Me and Jimmy the Mole are coworkers. Not like in person, but... You guys don't high-five in the hallways? Buddy, I don't even go to work. I mean, physically? It's been a minute. Actually, it hasn't been that long because I had to go on that one day. That was rough. Did you cry about it? Mm-hmm. The whole time I was like, wah, wah, wah. Yeah, that sounds about right. Yeah, so you know. I don't even know why I asked. <laughs> I don't know either, Michael. I really don't. You guys would be absolutely shocked how I sound on the phone in my professional setting. Yeah, it's actually really impressive. One time I did it for them, like like a mock call, and they're like, who stole Michael? Who is this person? Like, we joke, but like at my job, like, they're considering management for my future. <laughs> Do we have an Eldrazi in here or anything that shuffles? I don't think so. So I'm just going to concede the game. Let's try. I'm bringing in Fatal Push, bring in Vraska. Skyclave apparition. The moment I turned 40, I farted. It was then that I realized nothing. That's, I real, I that's realized deep. nothing? I realized nothing. We have a scholar in our midst. Toski seems a little slow. See you later, Toski Broski. This is a good one. To poop on. Wow, cool. <laughs> Super cool. You know does, what? Does Toski draw you a card for every creature that deals damage? Every creature that's ever lived. <laughs> You're going to deck yourself immediately. <laughs> Maybe you are. That's like 40,000 creatures. There's probably not 40,000 creatures. There's like 40,000 cards. Someone could probably look it up. You think I can hit a green source here? I believe. Oh, what up, chat it? The question is, do you? Sounds like Josh VS is trying to trying to show you up, bro. You can look us up. We're kind of a big deal. <laughs> you know what I mean? I feel like every good position involves a little bit of luck. What about your dad? Didn't tell you. Because he's too busy diamonding without you? Let's see if we get to play could Magic. Very nope, well be, didn't think so. He Sounds could be good. diamonding. Nah, my point is that I'm lucky and I have no idea how he ended up here. Yeah, Josh, I think we've gone over this to like... I think you, you underestimate were, yourself though. You've been doing you've been doing this for a while, so I'm pretty wasn't sure. Like, I could be misremembering, but it wasn't like you were doing another job, you weren't technically qualified what you do now, but like you've been working there long enough and they like kind of positioned you into that position? Josh's like, whole story is that he's never qualified even though he definitely is, I bet. Hmm. I might be thinking of somebody else. 
Is he your dad? No, I often don't think about him because he's a piece of shit. <laughs> Remember when you were drunk and you went off on that big tangent about your dad? And you were just super aggro? No. Oh, really? Nope. Huh. I, I don't, uh, I don't think I was I on stream. Yes. Well, I was drunk, so apparently, yeah. so it's hard to remember things. Also, if it was anywhere f more than like a minute ago, it's probably. Uh, yeah, I play arena sometimes, uh, but when there's a cube up, either vintage cube or modern cube or whatever, I'm just going to play. Have you heard about them making more digital oh. only cards? I see. Um, if anyone's got the clip, it would definitely be Affinity. Ulamog, huh? Can I deal with that? I mean, I, I don't remember so. my dad is a, is a raging piece of shit for sure. Oh boy, we're just losing to all kinds of bullshit. Storm into Ulamog. First round channel into into natural order. Like, come on, man. Yeah, Jess, but that's kind of like everybody has a little bit of imposter syndrome. Like, you're always gonna if you're looking for it, you're always gonna find someone better at what you do, right? Oh, I'm a, I'm I'm the biggest imposter I know. Like, I'm doing my record, I'm O2. Like, I'm definitely not a professional artist or anything, but I've definitely gotten better over time. But like I still look at my art, I'm like, this is shit. I should burn it. Totally is shit. How dare you? No, it's not. He should do more art. But he doesn't because he's stupid. So what are you going to do? I just did the thing the other day. Oh, he did the thing. Yeah. Oh, did you see Michael do the thing, guys? Oh, he did the thing. Well, oh. if they follow me on the socials, they probably saw I did the thing. What social? What thing did you do? The bees? The bees. With the, with the, that shoot bees out of their mouth? Yeah, the squirrels. You remember. <laughs> Michael, like, oh, what are you going to do? Release the dogs or the bees or the dogs that shoot bees out of their mouth when they bark? I feel like there's some from something. No, man, I made that up. Bit. Totally just made it up on the spot. So I was hanging out with my 23-year-old former co-worker last night. He just bought a plane. <sighs> well, then. It's painful. All right, let's do it. This is our this is our Lonnie's hand. Buying a plane at 23? I think you're doing all right. <laughs> Good game. Sorry for the potentially unfun games. Oh, they they realize their potential for sure. Good games, Tornado. Good games. Oh, uh, should it, that's not actually a dumb question. Um, that's because he has like a like a more real job now. So that's an old goal because he hasn't streamed in a while. Yeah, it's just an old goal. I mean, I left it up because it's funny. And if people want to support me, they're still they're still welcome to do so. No, this is actually for next May. You I could also just I, subtract I have it in advance. You could also just take away the, the month and just say rent, you know, more generic. But right. it's kind of funny if you keep Wow, it. you're so smart, Michael. It is kind of funny if you keep it, like, always back. Like, eventually when you hit May, you'll just do, like, June, even though it's, like, who knows what how. What if I go backwards? When I hit this, I go to April. But then, then people are going to think it's for future, though. They well, can think this is for future, though. Yeah, so why you know wouldn't what? they think that already? Like, that's not, like... Mike's the solution sure. engineer over here. Yeah, maybe Mike was... Uh, Kerwitz coworker that bought a plane. Wow, they manatized me. Boy, it's really all happening. Our opponent goes turn one giver, turn two mother, manatize. <laughs> it's just like it's all just happening. Oh, Jimmy wasn't wasn't fooling. He's like literally. Uh, seven right fifty would be cheap if that was my total rent and I didn't have two other people splitting it with me. Yes, seven fifty would be very cheap. But there's three of us, so it's like our total rent's like twenty five hundred. And that's just rent, which is worse. Doesn't include like utilities and all the other stuff. I mean, we don't kind of afford it though, so it's whatever. Wow, do you see how you turn like into this is really sad into like humble brags? I can afford it. I'm a big man. I'm a big man with my monies. <laughs> yeah, Josh, are you still in San Francisco? Oh look, oh look, Black Lung. What? Wow, that's that's fascinating. Super aggro. Just run out Palace Jailer to do it, I guess. I mean, you're not putting that much power on the board, so. Yeah, but now they get to draw two cards a turn. So, you know. That is pretty cool. That is the coolest. Well, mortgage is always usually way cheaper than rent, right? It's kind of the upside. Except the fact you're locked in for like 30 years or whatever. Sammy, you got your own two-bedroom condo? I didn't even know that, man. God, Sammy's living his living the best life. I mean, this deck seemed fun, but we just really got 
stomped in these rounds. Into it. Oh. And yeah, a lot of California look at this. Look at this. Look at this collector's edition Mox Emerald, right? Does this look like a 6.5 from the front? Definitely not. No, right? Like in the back, like. I think they're. I think a six point five is just really like. I mean, I get it, right? Because like, okay, the corners are. Are a six and a half, sure. Is that like a glare right there, or, where, on the top? Is this, weird? yeah, yeah, okay, mm -hmm. yeah, but like, I mean, it's. I don't know, man. Me no no. So I have one creature, but you have two ways to protect your creatures, huh? I've invited you and Mike over, but you know you hate me. Oh my God, Sammy! <laughs> Good Lord, man! Where does he live? Up your butthole! Oh, I'll be there soon. You'll be up your butthole soon. Yeah, I'll just go. It's pretty wild, dude. Loop on in, you know. You ever loop on in? I just said yeah. You didn't say yeah to loop on in. You just said loop on in, yeah. And then I asked you the question. But you didn't say yes to answer the question. You just I said feel like yeah. it was implied. Just, I hadn't even asked the question when you said yeah. How would that be implied? If you don't know, I can't tell you. I hate you so much. <laughs> Living in an 85 meter squared condo for 750 euros. I mean, like all of those all of those words are just foreign to me. I don't know. I don't know what meters are. I don't know what euros are. <laughs> Oh, good. Wow, they really just have everything. I think you know what they are. You just don't know the conversion, right? <laughs> Who could say, man? I'm not... I don't know what's going on. Yep, guess I'll take five. Boy, they're really doing well here. Kirby, the only reason we haven't been in your house is because of the pandemic, pretty much. If there's any normal stances, we would definitely visit you by now. Normal stances? Yeah, normal stances. If it was under normal stances. Yeah. Michael, why are you so fucking weird? Well, I'm a little above weird right now because I'm really tired. I'm above weird. <laughs> Y'all ever been above weird? Oh, good. A goose. A shitty, stupid goose. That goose is your friend. Just because he's a little late to the party doesn't mean you need to talk shit about him, okay? That's exactly what it means. He has a family. No, he doesn't. Americans don't know their metric system, but measure their bullets in millimeters. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's gun math. It's different. Actually, I, I don't know anything about Jesus, guns, really. that I, is so... I know, like, stone zero by guns. Stone zero. I know you can shoot him. Pew, 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 yeah, pew, pew. Pew, pew, pew. And then do a big murder. It's big murder. Taking a train from Seattle to Chicago, that's got to take a minute. It takes one minute. Yes, you're right. That's obviously what that means. That's definitely what that phrase means. When someone if you miss South minute. Africa, I can give you a Florida play commander on. <laughs> oh, wow. Look how big that's their all creatures are. They all get plus two, plus two, huh? See you well, later. See you later is right. Oh, look at this hand-painted swamp. I wonder what the rest of the car looks like. <laughs> oh, I just realized the worst detail about it. Oh, yeah. Why does it See have... that? Oh, yeah. God, it has a bit on it, too. See that other stuff? If you need more photos, please feel free to ask. Oh, God. Yeah, it's like hand-drawn, which is weirder. Yeah, because someone's, like, sitting cool. there, like, all right, let's make a little bit of this, a little bit of this. <sighs> Embercleave is a good one. A little, little pushed, but it's it's pretty good. How do you feel about Embercleave, Michael? The manner? It's pretty fair. In real life, Michael. In other formats? It's pretty busted. As soon as I see this little white mark in the corner, I'm like, no, I'm out. What are they doing? Just attack me. I'm at 11. I don't understand Bro, what's going but, on. Bro, but like, it's, it's five cents off Just compared kill to the other me. one. Kill me. That's true. It How is many moxes you got left for the collector's edition? Two. I need two more moxes. This and one and all of them. which one? Emerald and Jet. 
Jet. The altar scene on eBay is a bit, yeah. Yeah, that's my concern. Like who who's who's buying that? It's not even drawn well. Really? It wasn't really that bad. It's not good enough to pay for. Really? I think it's actually fine. The line works good. Like the shadowing is good. Like this is just fine art. But like if, if you're paying for something like that, you want it to be at least as good as like manga quality, right? I mean, not for 30 bucks. I guess I'm just not in the market for a $30 pornography swamps. <laughs> no, I'm definitely not. <laughs> I'm not saying you are, but I'm just like, I guess I just don't know that world. <laughs> so yeah, maybe you it's just a good deal. Yeah, you just don't know your your anime titty proxies <laughs> well enough. That's all. Well, I don't think it's a proxy. I think it's an altar, right? Yeah, that's what I meant. Hey, but if you buy like 20 of them, then it's like, it's kind of a, it's a bling deck now, right? Because it, it's cringe, but like, it's kind of an expensive mana base, right? Yeah, right, right, exactly. You're like, yeah, man, this is totally cringe and not really appropriate for play, but I sure paid a lot for it, so. Well, it's a rule zero. I can play whatever I want. You sure can. Buy yourself. In Knock the yourself out, buddy. Michael, I'm getting the impression you don't really, uh, you don't really appreciate. Never it. look for lily altars. Oh boy. I wonder if our opponent is still there. You can substitute any magic character there, and it's probably pretty rough. <laughs> Do you think they got some, uh, some weird euro altars? <laughs> he's like an old man, but he's like, you know. Euro altars. Yeah. Like someone made a porn Uro. Uro? Yeah. Oh, you, oh Euro. Yeah, like Got this it. weird old man face. Because you were talking about like Euros. Like e no, 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 no. And I'm like, Euro alter. It's like, no, like, Euro? G What's not like, like G-Y-R-O, you know, like the sandwich. Euro, yeah. Or like, the taco. I don't know if it's a sandwich or a taco. I don't know what the classification of that eating device is. Eating device. It's not an eating device. That would be something that, that helps you eat. I mean, tacos help me eat. No, they are what you eat. They're not helping you eat. Well, otherwise, it's just all in my hands. How am I going to eat it that way? Don't be stupid. <laughs> Michael, have you heard of a uh, fork? I actually I almost, I, I, I almost feel like that's a good argument. It was so dumb, it blew my mind, and I can't argue yeah, with it. Yeah, tacos do help you eat what's inside of Wait, them. are those just like... Wait, hold on, scroll up. These are Dan Frazier altar artist proofs. Okay. So they are Dan Frazier, so Thank it's actually legitimate. That's worth it, got. Oh my god, Odysseus with the 10 gifted subs. You guys are freaking amazing. I really appreciate yeah, all that. I didn't really guys. see the art at first or the altar part. I was like, wait, why are these so expensive? Man, Canadians are so cool. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Thank you. Man, those lands are wild. Dude, I, yeah, I ordered play sets of. Uh, Kerwitz showing me all of his. Um, the new showcase cards from. Thank you. Um, Adventures of the Forgotten Realms. And I ordered a bunch of play sets of, the, of all the creature lands for modern. Thank you. I wish they were more broken. Yeah, they're fine, but like they're also monocolored creature lands, which is pretty good. Oh my thank god, Josh, you. dude, you're awesome. Josh and Odysseus, thank you guys so much, man. Really appreciate it. They're not quite good enough for a commander, unfortunately. Thank so you. sorry, I just wasted so many people's time. <laughs> I mean, what are you gonna do? That's thank life, man. You. Wasting people's time is life, you know. Thank you. What is this? Four and nine? I'll just go to two here. I don't even care. You don't even care. What are you going to do, bro? Thank you. It does sound like a sub train. Thank you. Can you guys hear it rolling in? Okay, we're just done here. This is. Thank you. Okay. Let's bring you in. Bring you in. Bring you in, take you out. I the sub train is often followed by the rat train. Thank you. Send them on down to rat train. Have you ever been outside and got to call Thank on the rat train? <laughs> you know, often when I hear my bits, I'm like, there's no way that was me. You're like, this couldn't, is couldn't too good. Hey, no, Thank really, you. though. This is gold. I'm basically the funniest man alive. <laughs> okay, you're you're making it weird now. Oh, do you want to hear how funny I am? I have to go. 
So Katie hasn't responded for like Thank you. an hour, and I, and she was just like, I'm like, you hate me because I clog the toilet, and she's like, no, I'm just watching gymnastics, and I'm like, oh, thank goodness. Thank you. Oh my God, Odysseus with 10 more subs? Jesus. Hey, can you believe how long that turtle's been doing that? He's definitely winning for sure. <laughs> thank you. It's been like hours. <laughs> Oh my god, Odysseus, thank dude, thank you. you so much, dude. Really, really appreciate you. I would like to play first. I'll would keep Would you this. like that? Would you like thank that, little Jimmy? You. Yeah, Pa. Oh, I'd really enjoy it. Thank you. Oh my god, Odysseus. Josh, you guys are amazing. I love you guys. Thank you. All of my heart and soul. I'll give you a little G on that. A little tee hee. Mm -hmm. um, Thank you. Yeah. All right. So we're just gonna play this because we need two white. So we might as well just get the get the ball rolling here. I'm about to break, you know. Thank you. What does that even mean? I'm not amazing. I'm just drunk and have excess income. Yeah, but if you're drunk and your instinct is to to Thank donate you. to uh, a streamer to support them, like that's pretty good, man. I'm gonna be honest with you. There are significantly worse things you could do when you're drunk. It's just because you're a shill for yourself. And I'm about to break. <laughs> nice. Even me? Oh, Sammy, you are awesome, buddy. Oh, man, I should make a, a rat train commander deck that'll be all rats. Just for the memes, you know? Sammy, I think your only negative quality is your, is your self-deprecation. I think you are way harder on yourself than you should be ever, and uh, it makes me kind of sad sometimes. Is there an animal in here? <laughs> Is there an animal in here? Oh, it's hunting. That sounds that's Michael when he's high. Is there an animal in here? I thought that was toe chomping. Toe chomping and it feels I like that even though we're not paying attention, he's like, I'm gonna hang out with you guys. Hunter? Yeah, because why, why would he he don't need attention? He's a great animal. Can you even imagine what would happen if I got drunk? No, especially because you're from Utah. No, you're not. You're from Canada, but you have a history, a Utah history, though, right? It's the name of my folk band. Utah history? Mm -hmm. That's good. That's a good name. Man, those retro frames are so banging. The only problem I have with retro frames makes me want to buy the retro onslaughts. By retro, I mean just, you know, onslaught. Well, I bought five for my cube, so now all my, my 10 cube lands are Aren't retro. Aren't those, like, pretty expensive these days? They're, like, 40 to 50. That's it? Whatever, but man. There are more. Oh, what up, Chris? Oh, Odysseus, I'm a high and have excess income. <laughs> Man, I appreciate you guys. If it isn't old Christopher Christensen. Hodge Gulash is classy. He knows what's up. But my other cube, I have two cubes. I actually put the Live, live the Dream to cube together. And the, the fetches I have in that one are all, um, what do you call it? Uh, the Zendikar Rising Expeditions. Pretty graceful for a fat guy as my punk man. <laughs> How are those wings, Chris? How's your challenge? Oh, what up? Oh, what up, Chris? Chris, when are you coming to visit? Never. He hates us. What are you going to blink? You're going to blink your legions landing? Destroy a creature if it has mana instead of permanent. You control left the battlefield. Monday we'll have big cube vacation. One, did you say one day? Yeah. Ha, one day. Wings are tomorrow. Okay. I pray for your bum hole. I, feel, I just got done watching Leprechaun 4 in space. Well, they made four of those thing. things? That's three too many. It's four too many, actually. Touche. Oh, the first one's kind of a meme, so. There's 11 of them? Oh, wow. No, I don't like that. I'm not, I don't know how these mana bases... I don't know how these things work. There we go. We figured it out. Big chumpa lumpa. Ravenous That's what I call my belly. Chumpa. <laughs> That's my big chumpa lumpa. Oh, eight. Only eight. That's that's much better. That's much more reasonable. Are you okay? What are you doing? My back hurt. You want me to punch you in it? No. Actually, no. Depending on where you punch, that might work. Well, I'm a chiropractor, so... You're not. Prove it. But I mean, 
you know, it's probably just as good. You think so? Yeah. Hmm. I mean, scientifically, it's about the same. Looks like we made it. Leprechaun 1, 2, 3, 4, in space, 5, in the hood, 6, back also, to the hood, I was really 7, origins, for an in there, 8, returns. Wow. Instead, we didn't get it. I'm Kinda. really hoping for an Alesh Norn at some point. I'm sorry. I'm too busy understanding these 8 Leprechaun films. That's okay. I'm just talking to the audience and hoping that they're still interested, even slightly, in the, uh, in the thing that's happening here. We were supposed to come and visit, but somebody ghosted on the plane. Now, ghosted? Was it the Leprechaun? See, that was funny. I went, it was a little throwback of Leprechaun. Oh, that's good. You didn't like that? No, I did. I just, I'm very tired. You're making me feel much less funny than I am, and that's that's kind of... That's your own personal vendetta. Your Being own personal wolf. vendetta is, my, is the name of my band. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. That's going to be some... Super cringe music. <laughs> My favorite villain from Star Trek, Leper Khan. Wow. Khan. That was a terrible voice you did. Khan. It's the best I can do. It's <laughs> probably not action. So we can shoot something, but then they just give it pro. So that's not great. So I'm just going to re get this guy. Yeah, do a good re get. Yeah, do a little re get. Re getting cat. I think we're just gonna go 06 here and it's gonna be just the worst, but yeah. I don't think we really ghost on the plans. It's just like we said we needed a minute, but then no one ever said anything again. So, yeah, I feel like you're blaming me and I hate you. So, <laughs> what you can do about that? Strong words. Wasn't Leprechaun a Star Trek villain? Yeah, yeah, it was. Everybody knows Leprechaun. Hey man, you doing some zaps? Yeah, I'm doing some zaps. <laughs> All the kids are doing them. Look at this blink dog. Why is it a blink dog? I really wish they didn't bring oh, it's phasing back. Blink I'm gonna dog. be honest. Like, I, I feel like more phasing than... is kind of confusing, and I just don't feel like learning the ins and outs of it. Oh, is there more than just the instant guy? The instinct guy? The instant, the three drop that like phases your guys for a turn. Yeah, this blink dog says teleport four mana. Blink dog phases out. I'm just like I don't, I don't know if I understand. Like, it's kind of confusing, and I just don't feel like learning it. Not really. Oh, I'm sorry. My bad. I, I didn't know that you could determine what's confusing for me. Well, to just think about this. They essentially just don't exist. And then they do exist when they're done. Uh, define JRPGs, Josh. Okay, so they're just killing it. Ren Reynolds and Sixold. At least that was always my understanding of phasing. It's like, they just don't cool. exist for the time. They don't go away. Just put a blanket Yeah, but over. that's weird, right? They just don't exist for the time. Just pretend they don't exist. It is weird because like people get confused. Like, so does my token die? And it's like, actually, no. Yeah, right. That is confusing. So it comes back. It doesn't have the enchantments anymore, right? Actually, it does. That's why um, fairy's protection is a banana banger. You can save your tokens. Yeah, someone did start a new one. It was Mike. Not me. Other Mike. Wait, what? Who is... Who? What? Me? No, no. Is Katie not in that? No. This is not a very good chat. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Why didn't they just use the original? It didn't go away, right? No one deleted it. I don't even think you can do that, but... Also, like, who's this person that I don't... Why is this other person in here? All right. It also is weird because if we don't know them, I don't really want to invite them to our home. If you guys are watching on YouTube, you're probably just watching for the banter at this point because the games themselves have been extremely terrible. Well, you can look at our board and then you can look at their board and you can see how our board isn't. I mean, I mean, if we top deck a Leshnor, it might be fine, but maybe not. Who knows? One, two, three, four, so, five, six. I guess we'll take six and go to four. I guess that is an out. 
Can they flash in like an honor the pier? Is there a flashing honor the pier? Dictate of Heliod? I don't think that's in the vintage cube. I don't think so either, but like. Palace Jailer, again with no targets. Fascinating. Okay. They target something if you had one. So smart, Michael. <laughs> so smart. They target something if you had you're it. Right. I guess you're right. Okay, well, Alesh Norn or bust here. Let's let's go Arid Mesa because we're gonna die regardless of whether we crack it or not. So see that would be a perfect time for your little sound bite there. Which one? I like the way you die. <laughs> <laughs> you're right. God, that movie's so good. On time. Can just watch it again for no reason. God, that's really that feels really close, right? What? Oh. Well, all right. <laughs> I guess we're getting to game three. I think they, I think they, they probably know we're sure. And so they're just, they're, they're just, doing it for the, the entertainment. Yeah. They're doing it for the value here, which I appreciate, which is good. That's fine, buddy. You're all right. Good question. In Lord Wingrace, how many basics would you normally run? That's a really specific question. <laughs> Michael, tell us about your Lord Windgrace knowledge, your Black Panther knowledge. <laughs> well, I've actually often considered building it because it's pretty pretty cool. I was going to put it in my queue until he was foil only, and then I was like, nah, I don't like that. Oh, gross. Never mind. I can no longer answer your question. I'm just kidding. If in Commander, is actually fine to have a foil because it's outside the deck, so it doesn't matter if it's bendy. Um, also, I think the foils from that Commander set aren't too bad. Anyway. Um... Also, like, they, they said if I was watching, I would want it. So, yeah, I mean, like, and also Vintage Cube is just about the games for me. Like, I would rather have more games to play in Vintage Cube. True. That makes sense, actually. Uh, Rax and Sam, yes. what is your land budget? Before I answer the question. Other, you can also call it a ludget. That's yeah, what's a, your ludget? That's a common term in the magic community. Uh, if you're talking about land budgets, you call it the ludget. Do you got all, like, the shocks, fetches, duels? That's going to... Alter the question. The ludget. Yeah. He's really trying to coin this term, you know, so. Ludget. Oh. 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 Dang it. This stupid black on here adult means we can't play it. Oh, biscuits. Selection fetches the max. I'm actually kind of maelstrom pulsing this. Because then it also kills the mother. They do draw two, but do they care about that? I don't know. We know now. I think I'd rather just start hitting lands. Because without lands, it's all over. So if you don't have the duels... Does Jund have a tri-land fetchable? Jund, no, they only have it's the, only enemies, right? Enemy uh, wedges? yes, it's all it's all of the like, so um, they don't have band, so they wouldn't have Jund, right? Yes, it's all of the cons of Tarkir lands, not the shards of Alara lands. They are um wedges, not shards, right? They're the cons, not the shards. Oh, exiled palace jailer for that solitude. I'd probably say like 10 basics if you don't have duels. It's too many. It's like you're not even trying. Maybe a little more. Maybe a little more. It depends on how many effects you have that fetch specifically basics as opposed to any kind of like a forest or whatever. This could be bad. It might be. It, I just want to hit a green source or like a land. Any land will do. Well, I can say, if you're like actually interested, if you can send me like a base list, I could recommend a better mana base for you. I don't know a lot, but I know a lot about Commander. A lot. Also, if you do, send me what the goal of the deck is. Does he know how to get a hold of you? I think we're on Facebook. Okay. Not 100%. Did you play FF7? That's the most classic. Um, I mean, okay, so by Japanese RPG, you're just talking about an RPG by a Japanese company? 
Uh, it's more the like the turn-based style. Like a more traditional. Oh, interesting. I didn't know that. I'm pretty sure that's what JRPG I wasn't sure what that to. term was was a uh, was relating to basically, as opposed to like because Fallout. I actually I actually love JRPGs and um, did you marry him? I think so. You know, well, Katie's gonna be mad then. That's true. You're gonna have to pick one. Oh, I'm wow. That was terrible. That was exactly not what I wanted to do. Holy shit, that was really bad. Um. Oh, f I just got really distracted by our JRPG conversation, and now I feel stupid. Um, one, two, three, four. We have five. You're still not cracking, right? Wow, that was so stupid. I meant to tap this for a white instead of a green, and then I immediately slammed this. I was going to play Omnath, then double double this. We can still back up the to, to make white, right? At least. Yeah, this is a misplay. Oh, sorry. Apparently, Chris is also in the race for the marriage. So, with me? Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> I like it. That's very nice of him. Um, we got the double blue now. We got double white. Yeah, I think it's just a scrubbery. The here. goal is probably to win. In commander, it's actually a little tricky. Because depending on who you're playing with, if you're trying to win too hard, it can be a really awkward experience. Have you ever played JRPG Blue Dragon? Uh, no. Let me know how much I at the end of the match. Oh, Will do, Josh. I'll, I'll bill you. He'll have his people talk to your people. Uh, I mean, I play Final Fantasy VII in, in several forms. I've pl I haven't played the new one, so I guess I haven't played it. I, play, I, played, it in, I played it for PS1. You know, you know what I mean? You know what like I'm saying? The, the version it came out on? Yeah. Yeah, you know, it, that's the, the version only it version? came out on. It came out on that version. Mm hmm Gotti. Did you? Buddy. Who knows? I have heard the, uh, the remake's pretty banger. I've heard really good things about it, too, yeah. But there's, like, two parts, so we can just wait until the other part exists, you know? I wish they remade Final Fantasy 3 slash 6. That would be actually my favorite. That's literally my favorite FF game. Give me just a little more Michael B lives in the sea. Chicken tender slowly. Yeah, that's good. Get it's in one, there. It's one of my favorite songs. The chicken tender song I just wrote? I understand. Just pick your nose. Pick my eye. Just pick your eye? Yeah. You know what they say. You can pick your friends, but you can't pick your eyes. What? Joke's on you. I just did it. I'm very confused. I know. That's life, though, right? Being confused? Unfortunately, yeah. Are you makes... still going to town? Oh, my eye, yeah. Wow, that's wild. Didn't get out, you know? One day you will. This is, like, the only game um, that we're even close to winning, and it's the one they, that we're only playing by the by the goodness of our opponent. I know so I'm just going to I'm just gonna scoop at the end of the... When, he, like, when we have, like, lethal... Had a pretty great story, but FF 36, 36 was also my, like my absolute favorite storyline. I loved like the light world and the dark world and like everything that happens and like the, the I love Kefka as a villain. I love I don't the think characters. I actually played that. Wow, you are the actual much younger worst. than you. Yeah, I'm the worst, huh? Yes, correct. I mean, as a young boy, you only have so many video games in your budget, you know. No. False. You're an adult now, Michael. You've been an adult for 20 years, 15 years. Some amount of years. It's been a long time. Greater than it's seven. Been a long time, been a long time. The answer would be 12. 13, depending on your definition. Never played through Chrono Trigger completely, but when I did play, I think it, it Chrono awesome. Trigger is actually really hard to play through completely because they have like a ton of different endings. It's definitely one of like the deepest Super NES games ever. Like it's extreme. Like, I, it's so deep. It's such a deep game. You wouldn't even know, bro. You don't even understand. You wouldn't understand. Mm. 
You wouldn't get it. Smoke cigarette. Joker meme hashtag. What? Yeah, on the Joker movie, he's like, Danny's like, you wouldn't get it. Yeah. Wow. Remember that scene? Surprised you remember that. Oh, it's a, it's a meme. Oh, yeah, it's a meme. Oh, it's a meme. That movie was fucking dark. <laughs> Let's activate this thing, am I right? I wonder how many children went and see that, saw that movie and their parents were very upset about showing them it. It's going to be three lands. Oh, that was... Oh, that was a banana bonanza. Man, those lands are really cool. They These are a lot good of looking lands, They can bro. attack. They give all your creature stuff. That land is activated. You know what? They don't tap for mana, though, so I think you're probably... It's a bad pile. My Gilded Goose can also attack because it has Float and not Defender, Michael. You know, if it had not Float and not Defender, it could still attack. The first Final Fantasy I played is 10, so I don't like the older graphics of 7 or 9. Uh, then you definitely would not like the graphics of like 2 or 3 because those are just like 64, like 8-bit. It's not 8-bit, right? It's like no, 64-bit. Some amount of bits higher than 8, but less Super than Nance a million. Super is 64-bit, right? Like it's sprite-based. It's really small. It's good times. So, like, I can definitely understand that because it's, like, an aesthetic thing. But if you can get over that, those are great games. But like, that's the reason I can't play Half-Life 1 because I'm just like, this is too hard. So, Half-Life 1, I think, is even worse. 16-bit. Got it. Oh, my God. I was going to scoop. Dang it. Ugh. Either way, that opponent was sweet. They said, uh, good games. Thanks for all the vids. They mean a lot to people who can't play themselves for whatever reason. So that's super sweet, man. Nice. Seagull, if you see this, I was totally going to scoop that round, and I really, really appreciate uh, giving us a third round, a third game. Thanks for being cool, huh? Yeah, thanks for being super awesome, man. Really appreciate it. And thank you guys for watching. Really appreciate all of you. If you're watching on Twitch, I'm not leaving. But if you're watching on YouTube, slam those like and subscribe buttons. Be sure to follow the channel. You can go to Twitch and give your Twitch Prime sub if you'd like. It's a great way to support the channel. I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching.